You know what they say about a woman's intuition? It's never wrong. But would you be willing to put your money on it? This firm went through 8 million investment accounts and found that women's investments earned them more money than men earned from theirs. The biggest reason being that women take fewer <coughs> risks when investing mm. than men. While women focus on long-term gains, making trades periodically, men are more likely to trade spontaneously, timing trades to market news. Women spread their investments out, exploring safer avenues, but men tend to put most of their eggs in the stocks basket. This makes men susceptible to market bubbles in a way that women are not. According to this investment researcher, there hasn't been a single security, currency or asset class in history with an extreme gender divide that has been sustainable. Case in point, the dot-com boom of the 2000s. The gender divide in tech stocks was 80-20. While women shied away from the risk, men continued to pump money into the sector. Women even faced flack for not being as enthusiastic about the boom. That was until the crash, until men began losing tons of money. Moral of the story, if women aren't getting involved, it's probably too risky. Here's what all of this translates to today. Everyone's been speculating about cryptocurrencies, the new digital currency that can be used to purchase goods and services outside of banking and government regulations. While some people are pumping millions into this money of the future, others are expecting the cryptocurrency bubble to pop, leaving behind financial devastation. If we follow the scent of a woman, things don't look so good. Of the total engagement in Bitcoin, 97% are men and only 3% are women. Maybe this is just a case of women arriving late to the party. Or maybe it's a warning sign. But like we said, would you be willing to put your money on it? Like finance, an extreme gender divide can impact legislation. Watch our video about this and like and subscribe to our channel.